the ultimate act of kindness, donating an organ to a person you will never, ever meet. This is the reality for one Georgia woman who tells Atlanta News First reporter Sawyer Bussey she is sharing her story to give people hope. August 16th, it's like a birthday. And then once I found out what all was involved, I decided if I was cleared, then I obviously was meant to do this. As an organ donor, you might want to meet the person whose life is changing because of your gift. You might want to say hello to hear their story. Well, that doesn't always happen. They tell you up front you have to be mentally prepared to not know anything about the recipient. Um, some recipients don't ever want to contact um, for whatever reason. Karen Jones donated her kidney at Emory with help from an organization called the National Kidney Registry. Karen has a friend named Mitch. Mitch needed a kidney. Unfortunately, Karen wasn't a match. Her kidney went to someone else, but she did write his name on a voucher to help him get his transplant. There are no words. I mean, it's just such a priceless gift. These people that are out there that do this, I just... It's such a selfless act. The family tells me they were on the waiting lists at four different hospitals when they started working with the National Kidney Registry. We know nothing about the person that gave their kidney that he actually got, other than they came, it came from Arizona. If somebody needs it, I've got it. I don't, I can live just fine with one, so they can, they can have it. <laughs> it's, I'm not rich, so you have to give other ways. In Kennesaw, I saw your bussy. Atlanta News First. That was yeah. priceless.